Martha of Bethany is believed to have been born in the Ludea province, which is now in Israel. She was mentioned in the Gospel of Luke when Jesus visits the home she shared with her sister Mary. When Jesus was visiting, Martha was busy preparing the home to welcome him while Mary sat at his feet to listen and to hear his words. Martha, fed up with her sister's lack of help, asked Jesus to command Mary to help her. What Jesus said instead was, Martha, Martha, you are worried and upset about many things, but only one thing is needed. Mary has chosen what is better, and it will not be taken away from her. Martha was mentioned again in the Gospel of John. Before Jesus raised Lazarus from the dead, Lazarus' sisters, Mary and Martha, were called on by Jesus. Martha immediately ran to him, while Mary remained at home until she was called. Later, Martha spoke to Jesus and lamented he had not been present prior to Lazarus' death. She told him, If you had been here, my brother would not have died. And Jesus told her, Lazarus would rise again. Martha misunderstood and said, I know he will rise again in the resurrection at the last day. But Jesus clarified, I am the resurrection and the life. He who believes in me will live, even though he dies, and whoever lives and believes in me will never die. Do you believe this? She said she did, and added, I believe that you are the Christ, the Son of God, who was to come into the world. After calling Mary to join her, Martha witnessed Jesus raising Lazarus from the dead. Jesus loved both Martha and her sister, but initially Martha did not fully understand what it meant to follow him as a disciple. She did not comprehend fully the importance of prayer, worship, and putting him before all else. When he returned later, Martha understood and was quick to run to him. Her love for the Lord, living faith, and life witness led to her veneration as a saint in both the Catholic and Orthodox churches. She also received a special place of honor among Lutheran Christians, as well as among Christians within the Anglican Communion. Images of Martha, which began to appear in the 17th century, often show her working while her sister sits at Jesus' feet. Her feast day is July 29th, the same day as her sister St. Mary and brother St. Lazarus are commemorated.